what I have done and I have tried to do, and I'm not sure how successful I've been thus far, is to not, not excuse myself as the head of the agency uh, and the actors, but sort of do a little bit of reality check so that we all can appreciate the complexities of the work that we do. And to cut to the chase, for those who have thought that I knew, and looked the other way, and I can assure you that that was never the case. Had I known about what was happening in that clinic, which by the way, were criminal actions, I would have done something about it. If you want to know what I would have done, I would have contacted those with the authority to prosecute criminal matters. I would have reached out to the Philadelphia District Attorney's Office, to the police department, and say, look into this. Please look into this. I would have done it. I'm a man of faith, I'm a family man, I'm a man of values, and that's consistent with the way it always happened. I have the utmost respect for your integrity. Uh, I have the fullest confidence in your ability to perform the duties of this office. So I'd like to make a motion that this committee take no position on the nomination of Mr. Pedro Cortez, but that we refer unanimously uh, his nomination to the full Senate for a confirmation vote. Is there a second? Second is the bottom. Second is the bottom. Um, actually, I'm going to ask if there are any negative votes. Seeing that, 